So, what's your name? Uh, hi, I'm Dwight. Dwight Ko. Yeah. Okay. Meron pa. <laughs> Bing Tan. Aman Santos. Hi, I'm Mark Ruiz. Hi. Yes, we hi. <laughs> Reese Fernandez. Uh, ba Makino. Hi, Aaron. Hi. <laughs> okay, Aaron Ko. Hey, Aaron Ko. Okay. TJ Agulto. Uh, my name is uh, John C. Hi, my name is Cods. Puni, puni, puni. Conrad Chua. My name is Earl. Uh, yeah. Oh, Earl Yu. Manix. Oh, Manix. Manix Chua. Alright. Sa akin, first of all, sa akin sa greatest failure ko is uh, maybe yun yun time na malis ako sa bahay namin. Naglayas ako dati eh. Uh, may, ngayon na uh, nawala na magulang ko, parang nagsisisi na rin. Wala na nanay ko. Oh. Kaya medyo na-remember na, ko pa yung mga nangyari sa akin dati. Yun. Yan ang, yan ang pinaka greatest failure ko sa lahat. Na umalis ako na parang lahat ng mga lessons, uh, mga tinuro sa akin ng magulang ko, <coughs> maybe Partly, ano niyan? Uh, <sighs> mahirap eh. Basta mahirap. Ganun na nga yun. <laughs> Greatest failure ko is probably, you know, uh, not spending enough time with my family. Medyo madrama. Pero, you know. <laughs> Well, considering from my life, I don't think there is such a thing as failure anymore. I was born into a family where failure is a culture. So, parang lahat na failure, born into a failed family, then um, failed entrepreneur, failed mom. So, basically, I'm so introduced to failure that there's nowhere to go but up. What I consider to be my greatest failure is uh, maybe when I was a kid, I would always listen to... Uh, uh, elder people telling me that um, I should be a doctor and um, yeah for quite some time I think our whole family was uh, was uh, brought up to be in the medical field and uh, I believe that no? like many other Filipino families when you're young people will ask you what do you want to be oh, I want to be a and suddenly you'll be a uh, a shadow of your your parents or your grandparents. So for quite some time, I'd always tell myself, yeah, I wanted to be a doctor, which I ended up to be in the medical field. My greatest failure is those small moments when I would short sell myself, where I would not forgive myself for the things that uh, for the things that um, that I have done, or lack of self forgiveness and lack of self appreciation. Siguro greatest failure ko when I was in first year high school, yung math talaga first first three quarters ata parang bagsak ako eh tapos nung fourth quarter ang um, kailangan ko ata 95 para umabot sa average para hindi ako mag summer nung time na yun pero pero nung fourth quarter nung sinubukan ko mabuli yung 95 Inabot ko parang 92 lang, so <laughs> kinapos. So sinamer ko pa rin. Pero from that, na-realize ko na kung pinagbutihan ko lang sana yung first three quarters, di ba? Sayang eh, kasi dagdag pa ng hassle pa, di ba? <laughs> so yan, sinamer ko pa tuloy. <laughs> Actually, the, after leaving no, uh, corporate to in order to become an entrepreneur, yung mga... Unang businesses, actually, first couple of businesses nag-fail, no? Um, in fact, prefer nga namin ang business partner ko na i-bury na lang sila under the ground. But I guess I would consider them uh, my greatest failure, yung first couple of businesses that went under. This is actually, one is um, something on cell phones, uh, and the other one is naman training for call centers. Uh, they really, we tried very hard, but unfortunately, they just really didn't make it. Uh, my greatest failure would be probably um, one of the bad decisions I made that led to a failed investment um, not too long ago. Yeah, and um, it's still haunting me till now. And you have to work 
hard to overcome uh, that uh, that failure as well. Uh, greatest challenge basically is getting out of um, the old Earl, which is sobrang limited yung belief system. Na what I really I believe na before uh, before I used to believe that yung life ko is just inside inside the box. Okay. Na, para day in day out doing the same things and eventually uh, happiness or success will find its way to me. That's my that's my greatest failure actually. The guy that's my greatest challenge. Um, I don't have a greatest failure. Uh, I have a lot of small failures. Siguro everything from not achieving targets that you set out for your company or for yourself. Uh, little things, little personal things as well. Pero I think one of the one of my greatest strengths, I think, is that nothing can really get me down. And even if a lot of things don't go your way, you always have the strength to just try it again till it actually works. No, so parang I can't actually pinpoint one failure that really brings me down. Lots of small ones, but at the end of the day, it's the failures that you have that will make you try harder next time to make it to a success.